Hello my marvellous sausages, we've got another legend lost sector and today it's the conflux all confined in one room. Now I'm doing it with my hunter today, the last time I did it is with my warlock. But the reason I'm running it with my hunter is because the new seasonal exotic is the Gia Falcon's Hoburk. So I'm running it with my hunter to do that but of course you might be watching this video and it isn't a chest day but this build is just as equally loads of fun. Now before we do run the lost sector, just in case you don't want a chest piece today and you're after something else, arms or legs, we can do our little lost sector sector trick here by going in and making sure all our engram slots are full so that means that when you get an exotic engram it'll go to the post office and then you can decrypt that engram on the day of choice so for example you don't want it to be chest today so hold off on your decryption until it's a leg day and then decrypt it on leg day and you'll get legs nice so let's have a quick look at this baby we've got barrier champions unstoppable champion there's a solar burn void shields and scorched earth which is the most annoying thing about it which means they chuck loads and loads of grenades at you so what I'm doing here is I'm running my assassin's cowl. Whenever I kill someone with a powered melee, I get invisibility and my uh, health starts building back up again. Or also finishers do that as well. Uh, and with that in mind, I'm popping over here to my gunslinger. So I'm using my blade barrage and I've gone for gambler's dodge because you get a double press that recharges your melee ability, which then ties in with our assassin's cowl. But remember though, we've got to jump when you're in region of enemies, otherwise the melee won't recharge. So there we are, that's really cool, and that ties into our Assassin's Cowl in the melee. I'm using Knife Trick, because that's excellent, adds Scorch, and also spreads the nerve. And I've got a Solar Grenade there as well. Aspects-wise, I've gone for Knock Em Down and On Your Mark, because that gives us five Fragment slots. And all I'm looking for here is to get some Stat Booster or spread as much Scorched as possible. So I've gone for Ember of Singeing, Ember of Wonder, that gives us ten Resilience, which is handy there. Ember of Empyrean, Ember of Searing, and Ember of Torches as as well. So for my Assassin's Cowl, I've got a Bountiful Wells to double up on those popping out. I've gone Linear, Fusion, and Shotgun Ammo Finder, for that's what I'm carrying. And I've gone for Minor Mobility Mod, because that's all I can squeeze in here to try and squeeze out a little bit of half-tidy statistics here. I've gone for 93 uh, and 63 Mobility, but those are the two you really want to get as far up as you can, to be perfectly honest. Uh, for the Arms, I've gone for Seeking Wells, because it sucks them into me, yes. And then I'm going for Unstoppable Shotgun, and anti-barrier scout rifle. A bit of a fun change today. I'll show you that in a moment. And then I've stuck a resilience mod in there. Then for the chest, I've gone for well of life. So when I do pick up those elemental wells, they're going to give me some health. And I've gone for thermoshock plating twice. And I've gone for a resilience mod there too. For the boots, my well generation is coming through my melee well maker. I've gone for invigoration twice there. And I've also gone for mobility mod as well. And then on my cloak, I've gone for font of to give my weapons a bit extra kick. Uh, perpetuation, utility, fin which is very handy for getting the abilities back and I've gone for a mobility mod there just to squeeze that out. Weapons wise I've gone for reckless endangerment for the shotgun they stun the unstoppable straight away with the spread you can just hip fire them and it stuns them it's great. Now then for my exotic I've gone for my sky burner's oath. Why? Well it's scout so that's for killing the barrier champions but what's also good about it is that it hurts cabal it does more damage to cabal which is excellent and it also is solar so it spreads the scorched love as well. And then finally I was going to go for my Taipan for the Void Shields, but it's not worth taking in a Void. Taking a Solar, I'm taking in a Solar Rocket Launcher here. Don't forget to change over your uh, Ammo Finders as well to Rocket. The reason being I'm not worried about the Void Shields is that this Skyburner's Oath completely trashes them anyway, and if you hip fire it, these incendios with the Void Shields, hip firing it causes like a grenade explosion, and that triggers the backpack blowing off as well. Nice little tip there. So we don't need it. I'd rather take advantage of the extra damage with the solar burn. Right, let's pile on in. Now this lost sector is different to all the others as it's essentially one room so the enemies aren't broken up into separate rooms. They're all concentrated here and sometimes it can feel possibly a little bit overwhelming. Yes, but uh, don't panic. We'll just take them a bit at a time. So there we are. There's unstoppable idiot number one. Let's just uh, give him a bit of a nice close quarters kick in there and a finisher. Excellent, that's him gone. Next, there's incendiars and git bags over here, so we just want to try and take out as much of these guys as we can. So there's a bit of a grenade going on there, yes. Bloody legionaries there. Just use this area to pick them off, because they're going to be lobbing so many grenades at you. It can become very, very irritating, and of course they take cover as well. But there you are, there's one down, that's good, there's one down. Let's just go across the other side here. Can we see where the other one is? That's okay. There we are. There he is, look. They retreated right the way up the back. 
So don't worry too much about them. Let's finish that Colossus off. Change to my Skyburner's Oath. That's slowing me down. I think he's already just popped his shield. Look at that. Look, what a waste of a rocket that was. That really, really annoys me. No end. There's the shield come up again, but that's okay. We'll just finish him off. Look. Okay, that's him gone. Uh, we've got a legionary there. We may as well finish him off with a bit of this and get some invisibility back. We do have a few scions and centurion legionaries, whatever the bloody hell you call them, down here. There are, cop them. That's good. Let's try and finish him off from last time because he was the one who was shooting us from the very start. Sod off, you scion git. Right. Now we're going to go round here and do quite a bit of a stand from this picture because there's nice uh, protection with this nice big metal pillar here and we're also going to have oh there he is already look mr barrier colossus has already turned up fatal mistake didn't reload my rocket launcher he's already changed his barrier is going to go up in full strength and that's very very annoying how odd was that the scorched seems to have kept him down look at that look that's interesting he's not recharging let's just finish him off out the way good excellent that's barry champion down uh now we've just got another Ooh. <laughs> We've got another champion in the guise of a unstoppable. So we'll keep him on our minds. Whether or not he's going to pop around, we don't know. We'll just see. We'll just pick them all off as we go here. There you are. That bloody incendiary again. My super's up, which is nice. I'm keeping that, though, for the boss. Because he's got quite a large health bar. Yes. He's very, very annoying in that way, having a large health bar. But pick them off as much as you can. Is he around here? Oh, no, that's another incendio. They're very, very annoying. Let's knock his shield out. Shoot his backpack. And then he'll blow up. Okay, grand. Lovely. Ooh, nice bit of uh, reload speed there. What have we got here? Perpetual motion. That's us doing that. Okay. Goodbye, Legionaries. Let's uh, kill him. Oh, he's an incendio. I didn't see that. I thought he was a bloody uh, centurion. But there we go. He's gone. Okay, so then we've got... Well, let's pick him off here. Here comes old unstoppable trousers. Let's have a bit of a dodge to get my melee back. And let's just... Uh, into him. Two, three, four, five, and a uh, finisher. Thanks very much for the invisibility. Next, we have uh, the old bossage. Goodbye, Legionnaire. Yes. Okay. Oh, and there's another incendio. This is the worst thing. They keep on piling at you all the time. And, of course, that can be very, very annoying. But just take your time. Don't panic. Don't panic, as they say. Watch out for those gits. Every single person in this is uh, important in that bitch. I can shite in your face. Right. Let's just step out of the way. Yeah, I can see you. Yeah. Let's give him one of those. And let's just give him another one while we're here. Let's see his rockets coming in. Lovely. There we go. Just step out of the way. Have another one. Yes, that's good. Why not? Let's just pummel him. And another one. Lovely. Good. One more rocket left. And I think we'll just have the older thingy majiggy then to sort him out on and he'll be done look there we are i got my invisibility that's good let's just get my uh my uh, older full super on him right that's the boss done which is nice kill that scion there you gotta be careful you don't get to kill ed like i'm going to be here now in a nice bit of crossfire lovely invisible good stuff because you can get killed you just when you're trying to bloody mop up it's very annoying Okay, that shot him in the package. Let's shoot him in the package as well. Nice hip fire from this sorts them out. And that's it. Job done. Not too bad at all. I would really recommend bringing that solo one in there. That helps. And let's see what we're going to get. Ooh, we got absolutely nothing. You're so bloody generous. So there we go. Not too bad to do that one with the hunter. And on the screen now, you can see all the marvelous people have supported the channel by becoming Time Sausage members. Thank you so much. Here's your well-deserved credit. And if you're thinking about becoming a member, I've got a join button just at the bottom of the screen there. You can have a little click on that and see what's what. Thank you so much for watching. And I shall speak to you all again very soon. Sausage. Oot.